Hello again, it's Priscilla Batsell. I'm in Spring Hill, Florida. This is Expressionist Fluid Art Studio. This is a dry now, pre-primed with black, mead and black acrylic with uh, Floetrol and GAC 800 in it. Not that I really needed the GAC 800 since it's flat on. Anyway, so it's a 14 by 14 inch canvas. This is the spatula I'm going to use for most of the work I'm about to do. I want to do a a Northern Lights theme and there's a color art color called Bling It Boreal which I don't know if you can see that or not but it's very iridescent blue green gray and it's gorgeous and but I want to start with my landscape for whatever reason I just want to give myself some idea of some layers of scape in the background so I can put a sky in. Now I wanted to mostly play with the um, interferences and so I am going to do that on the black canvas and I'm going to start with some blue to some interference green and I'm hoping that this idea that I have of swiping up will work. I just watched a really cool method somebody used to do like I did I've done dots and swiped them up in the past. This is somebody has just decided it's time to mow something now. <laughs> Just my luck. All right, we're going to just keep moving on to some interference violet. And I'm going to put it above and below. Across your fingers. Is that enough paint? That's the question. don't really want a hard edge along the bottom. I think I'm going to put some more purple in. Right here. So I can maybe use it up at the top where it seems to have a bit of a gap. Now I kind of want to go down again, but I'm going to knock everything over. And I wanted to put a little bit of blue in below this, like maybe like not navy, but midnight. Because the sky is not always black. I've got a little bit of Chantilly lace with Prussian violet in it. Chantilly lace is a prism pour. I'm not sure if I did it in the right order or the wrong order. And I 
want to drag it up into that, but I'm not sure that's a good idea. So I'm going to try and drag it down. With just the paint that's on the blade of my spatula. And then, what am I going to do then? I'm going to smooth it out a little. I kind of want to rough it up, actually. Not sure I'm doing the right thing, but I... I wanted a slightly more interesting pattern than the one that looked kind of uniform. And that's how I'm going to try it out. Because nature is not uniform most of the time. Now I'm going to go back again. And this time I want to use some of this Thalo, the Atelier Thalo Turquoise. And I have some Prism Pour Twilight Orchid. And I'm going to throw a little more of this Midnight Shadow in. And I'm thinking, oh, I've got Black Iris. I have a silver cell activator. Which is Pebio's iridescent silver. So I'm just wondering about that big splooge I see right here. And I'd like to make it disappear and maybe use some more violet. That was the interference green. It's been a while since I did one of these. I did a few. I'd like to have some striations in the in the sky. I think I'm going to indulge in a little bit of sea glass, which is a primary element. And then I've got some sea monster if that doesn't make me happy. I still need to work on my bottom half. But I think that looks kind of like the Northern Lights. So I'm not unhappy with my result. And I am, I'm trying to just cover up a little bit of black canvas. Now it's time. I think I'm going to put some Chantilly lace down here in the bottom also. And for some reason I continuously keep getting called to this Quinacridone Magenta. Excuse me, Quinacridone Nickel Azo Gold, not Magenta. But right at the moment it seems like it's plugged. So I'm going to quick as I can undo that. 
It was the tiniest little clot. I'm just going to put a little tiny bit in there to see how I like it. And i got to remember this. There's cell activator in here. I kind of wanted to keep some of the black, but I don't think that's going to happen. Unless I put some more back in, and I could do that. That's the mead and black. I may wind up just making gray. I like that that area I had of Chantilly lace right in here. Oops. I kind of like that. It's a little accidental, but it's also pretty cool. I want some of that black up there. I also want some of that white up there. Imply some mountains or some hillsides in the background. And if I put some black in, I could probably, well, maybe white. I was going to say, make some trees. I'm going to use everything I've got on my spatula to go down over my edge. And there's just enough cell activator in there to make this interesting. I'm going to put a little bit more purple in there since, it, as it turns out, it doesn't seem to hurt anything that I have a little paint on my spatula. Interference violet. With a very light touch. I hope. I kind of want some actual purple. But I feel like I'm tempting fate. I want to see what the sea monster looks like before I call this good. Chantilly lace. Maybe in the bottom, too. I gotta do something with my sky pretty quick, though. There we go. There, I like most of that. I think I'll clean off my spatula just for intense. I was worried I might have left it sit there too long. I just rubbed my fingernail right through. All right, it is what it is until I do something else with it, which I kind of like to do, add some more layers to the bottom. And use my residuals on my edges and show it to you. That's my this year's version of the, uh, oh, I didn't bring my phone. I'll have to edit that out. 
I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I hope you were enjoying the view. Oh, wow. That's tremendous. I want to do it again right away. I should not play with things upside down. But I'm really loving how that looks. I hope you can see it. I've got... Uh, can't remember if I reset my timer or not, but I've got at least a minute to tell you guys. I love you and I, uh, I post it right now, 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. My link tree is underneath, show more underneath the video. You'll find a color art coupon code. You definitely want to invest in some of these interference colors. I got that bubble. Wow, that's a beauty. I'm a little concerned about that one weird shape in the middle. And I definitely want to keep trying to find and extinguish any bubbles. I should probably try and zoom in, huh? That would be such... Oh, I did zoom in. Yeah, I'm all distracted since I had to run off from my phone. Wow, that's gorgeous. <laughs> all right, well, I might just do that right, right away again on the 12 by 24 inch canvas that I set aside for exactly that. I love you guys. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. Please give me a thumbs up. Thank you for sharing my videos. Thank you for uh, the donations through PayPal. The icon is on the bottom right hand corner of my YouTube channel banner. I'm also a member of Patreon and I think there must be an icon there somewhere also unless I removed it. I've been updating Patreon. I'm going to have to keep an eye out for bubbles. That's not a bubble. That's an object. I invite you guys to come and join me again. Look for my link tree. Look on my link tree for Society6, the gallerist. Uh, <laughs> Pixels.com, Fine Art America. I'm so enamored. I think I'm going to leave that spot that I said I was concerned about because I like it in the upright position. That's just gorgeous. I want to do it again and again and again and again. Wow. Thank you for joining me. I think I said that. Wow. Amazon link. It's on the link tree. <laughs> My two bucks are there because I can in unlimited possibilities. They're the first and the second hundred videos I made for YouTube. Wow. <laughs> Definitely look for my paint pouring recipes underneath the video uh, in the description. Um, what can I tell you? Um, I think I've told you pretty much everything I need to, except for you can find my tomorrow's video posted on the community board most of the time. Questions are welcome. And anything else I forgot, spring clothing under the video. If you can't find what you're looking for, please ask me, because I can probably add it for you. Happily. All right, you guys, take care of each other, take care of yourselves. Wow, I'm so distracted. I'll see you in on. Bye for now. Priscilla out.